Hi everyone! Look who I got right here. We are getting ready to go to Target. This intro is coming at you at like... Oh goodness. What time is it? 6.38. We've had a super relaxing day. We'll give you an update in a minute. James's first trip to Target. And first time we're using our Nuna Pippa little attachment. Yeah. It's so weird. Oh my goodness. This, like this. And we're gonna put the, the cover on him. You look so cool, Jamesy. So we're here for a couple of things. Some of those things being our Thanksgiving treats. Gotta have a pumpkin pie. Yes, we do. Here we got a high tech situation now. We got the milk snob, so James is just like hiding in there, because it's a quick, it's it's a quick in and out to the target. Yeah. So we like we just have a, sh a short little list. Um, we're gonna decorate the tree tonight. What else are we doing tonight? Getting, giving him a bath. Yes, giving him a real submergible bath. Yes. And buying diapers for the first time for him. Yes. We've never bought diapers for him. No. But yeah, today was like a really chill day. We spent the whole day napping and relaxing. Neither of us felt good. I had a headache. It was I always. Had the Zinger Mountain Milk. Uh oh. Target has all the deals today. And we're gonna get this one. We picked out new stockings. And we got our Martinelli Sparkling Grape Juice. This is Sparkling Blush. It's apple and raspberry. Okay, guys, today was a first. We gave James a binky and he looks so cute. He's been so good taking to a bottle and. A lot of the times like he has been getting a little fussy just to like soothe himself not that he's actually hungry we weren't sure if he'd take it but he did learning new things every day we just spent the last 10 minutes in the parking lot trying to get James's uh, car seat adapter off of the bugaboo stroller because we've never done that before Gadgets. so we googled it and it was like a super simple Two buttons on the top that we just like when things are so aesthetically designed sometimes those buttons are like hidden into the, the theming of the thing what would we do without google we'd be fine without google we'll just struggle a little bit more <laughs> so we got peppermint bark from target and i for i just thought looking from a distance at the packaging it was the same kind that we used to get at macy's and i'm trying to think of what company that was it wasn't exclusive to macy's probably fanny may it, it might have been fanny may that it stacks on stacks on stacks of peppermint bark I opened this to these four little weirdly shaped looking like dittos from Pokemon peppermint barks. I'm sure it's going to be delicious. I just thought they'd be like this whole thing, like the one you get at Macy's does not have a, a holder, doesn't have plastic wrap, it's just stacks on stacks on stacks peppermint bark. Have I been in the vlog today? I have been in the vlog today. What am I, what am I talking about? <laughs> so, oh my goodness. James is really good at making bodily function noises with his mouth now. <laughs> and I'm always like, are you choking? Are you throwing up? It's and he's just, just like, crazy that like, so he's three weeks old today. How different he next is. Next weekend, he'll be a month old. Yeah. He, today was the first time that I like moved my head and he followed me. He like tracked Sarah. Like, wow. And he did it later with me too. Yeah. Um, so that was like mostly, he was checking out James. Um, that was mostly like our Christmas haul. I'm sorry, our Thanksgiving haul. What am I thinking? Um, we are actually getting Market on South Thanksgiving. We just put in the order. It's like a dinner for two, all plant-based. So we're obviously staying here this year for Thanksgiving, which is weird. Yeah. But, but we're making the most. Like, it's exciting, yeah, you know, like to be in our own home. Yeah. With a, we're we're just talking how and our it's... Baby. We would have missed going home for Thanksgiving and Christmas this year, COVID or not, because of James. Yeah. But it's such a weird year to miss because things are so different. It's almost like it's almost like a good year to miss. From a self selfish perspective. From so a like, selfish For instance, yeah. like today, like you guys know if you've been watching us, the Sunday after Thanksgiving our whole family drives to Michigan to cut down trees. 
they switched it. They went this weekend today, so, the weekend before, because it's less busy, but also because of COVID, not all the family went, and the store wasn't open. Yeah. It I was mean, all the different. the store's open, but just, like... Limited. Like, you couldn't yeah. hang out in there. Right. It was strictly yeah. for shopping. It wasn't for sitting around drinking hot cocoa and coloring. Right. And so, like, it was really bittersweet, because we know that some of the family did go, and it happened. Got some fun Snapchats. But it, yeah, but it just, like... It's it wasn't like the same that we were missing out on, um, so yeah, we're staying here for Thanksgiving, and it's also been it's been tough because there was plans for family to visit us, mm -hmm. um, with James being born, and eventually we will have some visitors. Yeah, but, but again, that's all like more COVID based, like is... because the the cases are always fluctuating. Yeah. We've got to be safe. Yeah, and we're from Chicago, and that has been a. Um, a new uh, spot. Yeah, a hotter spot recently. And so, yeah, it's like this weird balance of bittersweetness because we're like missing out, but we're also like embracing what's going on. Yeah. So we pick up our Thanksgiving dinner Tuesday. We have yummy treats from like traditions from Peter's side and from my side, and some of our own traditions. Can of cranberry. <laughs> yeah. Stuff like that. That, um, that we'll be able to have like our first little Thanksgiving. So we're making pizza now, mm -hmm. and we're finally actually decorating the Christmas tree after having yes. it for three days. Yes, <laughs> my headache is still running rampant, but I'm we're just kind of like rallying and um, hopefully getting like my belly full. I'll feel better. All right, the pizzas are looking ready. We got some good news and bad news. The good news is we're finally gonna get started. The bad news is Sarah's got a splitting headache and she's now got a fat lip. Her I don't lower know. lip just started swelling right now. What up. happened? You need to go to bed. <laughs> this is too cold. <laughs> you okay? <laughs> it is really cold. He's sweet as a button though. So now we're gonna finally decorate this tree. Don't mind that. We're gonna fix the star. <laughs> I just placed up there because I, I don't think this is the front. We gotta find the perfect side. Here's our bin of ornaments. And we're gonna do candy canes. I got new ones for this year. Had to cut down the top a little bit to make the, the star sturdy. Oh! Yay! Ooh, that looks great. We're gonna show you some of our faves. This is from when we got engaged. Uh huh. Peter stole. Um, those lights off the gazebo. <laughs> they didn't work, so it wasn't like he was stealing something and making something look bad. But it's still stealing. It's like, <laughs> oh, the Statue of Liberty's lantern doesn't work, so I'm gonna take it. Look at this. What happened to my lip? lip? This one is one of my favorites. It's just like a little clip on and it looks like it's just on the branch. Yeah. This is a special one that we got three years ago from our friends, Sean, Carolyn, and Dave. Um, we're gonna go see this stuff one day. I don't know if that's still there. This bridge is still there. We actually have the documentation to get James's passport application submitted. But this is all in Newcastle, Newcastle, England. My best friend Lauren gets us the White House as like official ornament every year. That one was last year, the helicopter. Or what is it called? It's not just any helicopter. Marine One. Marine One. And here are all the other ones since we've been married. She's actually quite busy this holiday season as she's expecting a baby any day. This is yours, Evie. You're so special. Here's another really awesome classic Pinocchio ornament that Sarah's Grandma Cookie gave us years ago. Actually a whole set of like classic glass blown uh, characters from Pinocchio. These are really special to us. We've now moved on to How the Grinch Stole Christmas. Sarah's taking a breather with her headache. And we are moving on to the candy canes. The goal is to hang them all up and to eat so many throughout the holiday season that you don't take a single one down. Oh, I just cracked one. Gotta eat it now. Sorry. Ready for this reveal? First of all, I don't think I've told Sarah enough how I think that sign really did pull things together for us in the room. Here is the tree. Decorated candy canes, ornaments, star, love. Eve got her made herself nice and comfy on this chair. And... Oh, the stockings. 
We hung our stockings up. We got new stockings, except for Eve. So that one there is Sarah's. Right? No, that one's mine. That one's mine. That one's Sarah's. That's James. That's Eve. How great. And you got Sarah know. here with the, these lights and the poinsettia. And we found our little... We found this one, which I feel like we had missing last year. But then now we can't find our first apartment ornament. Yeah. Ba -da -ba -da. Sarah's putting James in his pajamas. Today is November 22nd. Three full days left until Thanksgiving. Today's quote is by Helen Keller. Never bend your head. Hold it high. Look the world straight in the eye. Ooh, she's a little poet. So I just realized that with my sleep study Friday night and us being all crazy with all the mo Zinger Mountain melts and sleeping on here till 2.30, <laughs> that even though it's Sunday night... You exposed the time that we went to bed last night. <laughs> even though um, it's Sunday, I'm really looking forward to bed because it's like going to be the first hopeful yeah, solid sleep I'm going to get this weekend. Yeah. And we decided against the bath tonight because of how I've been feeling. And we just want to like enjoy it and why not so then i'll be tomorrow it's good, it's good to, to be, be home. home look at this little guy look at this little the guy sweetest angel. getting his belly full Just before the most, bad time the most special christmas season ever yes We know what our goals are, we know what we hope to accomplish, and believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions.